because we knew there's been some effluent overruns, there's been some other things that have gone on, there's been runoff by developers creating brown water, which is, um, we've seen pictures in the past. Uh, you know, it, it goes back to people and their love of the Ina. It wasn't just a complaint. It was mostly, it was almost from a conservation standpoint that people were approaching us saying, look, this is just not good. Not good for our waterways, not good for anybody who goes to swim in it. For that matter, there's a certain toxicity to it. There's pungent, you can smell. Uh, and we all recognize it's not good. They see the city making some efforts. Doc, Dr. Babcock, Roger Babcock from ENV, made some really good statements. We're working to control that, and if nothing else, to eliminate it.